I love jewels. I love jewels. I love jewels. Okay. Welcome to my YouTube channel, guys. It's lit. My name is Miriam. Um, I go by Miriam Salif well, on the channel, I guess. Um, I'm really excited about this. It's my first YouTube channel. And I've been wanting to start it for a while. It's just like, I just had too many excuses until I was like, you know what? Let me just start it. So, today's going to be basically a get ready with me-ish type of video. Um, I'm just going to show you how I achieve this look. Um, it's like an everyday look, kind of. Not really. Honestly, this is what I do when I go to school. So, this is the look. And keep watching. All right, I'm back. So we're gonna start off um, just by saying like what I use on my face already. So I prime my face. I wash my face. Um, I always use Jergens. Um, I think it's their hand. No, their body lotion. It's weird. I use body lotion on my face. It works. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, I just make sure my skin is like extremely, extremely, extremely moisturized um, to the point where like I'm like greasy. My face is actually getting a little dry right now. I need to put some more lotion. Just because like I feel like when I finish my makeup, it's like really dewy and it looks like my own skin. So I always use this. I you guys can see that. Yeah. Um, after my lotion. So I put on lotion first and then I add um, my primer. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and do my eyebrows off camera just because I can't see. So I finished my eyebrows. Um, I'm just going to go in with my foundation. Um, now I use NARS Luminous Weightless Foundation. I always have to like figure out how to do that. Um, but it's this. Oops. I love, love, love this foundation. Like, if you're looking for something that, like, looks like your own skin, and I'm gonna say that a lot in my YouTube, like, when you guys are, like, watching it, you're gonna see that I'm always saying, like, looks like skin. But I like for my foundation to look like my own skin. Like, I don't want to be looking like I have caked on foundation. No. So, um, I'm gonna use my Real Technique brush. Love these brushes. I've had them for years. I actually need to get a new one because it's like, yeah. Um, and then I always spray it with my, um, MAC Prep and Prime. This is an essential. If you don't have this, what are you doing? Alright, so I'm just gonna spray and then I just kind of like wave it off. And for me, like I think it's because the foundation sticks more on my hand. And you always have to shake this because it's like watery. It literally is like water. Um, but you gotta shake it first. And it feels like velvet, so I like it. So I'm just gonna apply. If you have like a lot of dark spots, you need full coverage. Well, you don't need it, but like I like full coverage. Um, because like I said, I like my makeup to look like skin, so. <laughs> um, so yeah, I always use, ooh, I hope I didn't get that on my eyebrow. I hope, um, <laughs> I mean, but also like, as you know, like the key to like really, really nice makeup and like smooth makeup is like really nice skin. And I'm working on it. Like some of you guys have like really bomb skin. Shout out to you guys. Like, there's like a... Alright, so next I always use um, my MAC Pro Long Wear Concealer. Um, I think this, this is in the color NC50. But yeah, so I just do a little a concealer around my cheeks to like conceal all those dark spots because it's literally like in a circle here. Um, I do the same thing on this side. But for some reason, I don't like wetting my sponges. That's weird too. Like, I don't know, I think it's just me because everyone else wets their sponges. But I use mine dry. I don't know. Um, so I just kind of like beat that in. All right, so after like I put concealer all over my face, <laughs> go back in and blend. Like every step for my makeup, blend. Literally blend. Are we moving? Are we moving? Yeah. My favorite song right now is No Limit by g -Eazy. I'm late. That's fine. I don't care. Whatever. <laughs> but that song is like, if I hit it two times, then I'm like, uh, I use this is really dirty I use the fit me uh, Maybelline um, concealer uh, this is in the color cafe it's number 30 I love this love love literally love this um, concealer and the application is amazing because it literally this is the application you literally can put this right underneath your eye and it will sit like let me get a little bit closer so you guys can see like Literally, right underneath your eye. Um, so I just put a little bit. I don't like too much on my forehead because I'm going to um, contour. I just put a little bit. And my lines are not going to be like some exotic, like, perfect, no. And then 
and my forehead I kind of do it in like a circular motion just so I get all the spots I have a big ass forehead like my wig is just making me kind of safe right now but my head is pretty big just so that my nose can be a little bit more Ooh. Ow. <laughs> I want to keep blending no blemish no more blemish liquid foundation it's like a makeup from like the, like literally the beauty supply like it's like four dollars um so i use that eat this much oh there's makeup on the rest of my hand but like just a little bit um i'm gonna put it right underneath my cheekbone do you see that like in dots Mascara. All right, so after all of that, I always, always bake. You know what's funny, y'all? Like, I used to never use powder, like not one ounce of powder, and I was thought I thought I was popping. I was like, you know what? I got this. Like, my makeup is bomb. And then like three hours into the day, like my face is oily. Like this whole section is just oil. Anyway, so I'm gonna use Sasha Buttercup powder. It's my favorite. Super, super, super light, and um, I like the yellow color just cause like it makes. It look more like bronzy, like yellowish bronzy. Chin, so everywhere basically where you highlighted. And then, just because I didn't contour my nose, I'm just gonna put a little bit on my nose. I'm gonna just, I don't keep it on for long because I feel like when you keep it on for long, it just creates like an ashy look. I don't know if that makes sense. But yeah, I just like dust it off immediately. Right, now for my favorite part of this entire video, like literally, I don't think I have loved this highlighter, any type of highlighter, as much as this. All right, I will literally be your endorser. Like, just give me this palette for free. Like, this is the best highlighter ever. Like, please buy it. My favorite highlighter shade, cracked and broke. I'm gonna sign this one. <sighs> Anyways. <laughs> these are the colors so my favorite ones are my favorite ones are sunray and golden dawn because it just gives you like a wow so this is sunray Woo! <laughs> it's lit are y'all seeing this wow wow mm. I want people from okay when I'm putting on highlight people need to see me like I'm not putting on highlight just to put it on I'm gonna just tell you that right now because I'm spending money on my banker products if I'm putting on highlight it's for you to see I'm gonna look like you just plop some highlighter which I literally just did for my final like section of the makeup um, I just put a little bit well this is from the morphe 350 it's a morphe 350 palette um, this is in the matte I have the shiny like the shimmery one but I'm just gonna use the matte because I'm not gonna do too much brush it's just like a Shader, I don't know what it's called, whatever. So I just take it just a little bit of this color. It's like a dark red. Um, and I just put that over on top of my eye. Just because I want like a little bit of something, some. Off camera, I just throw on some mascara. Um, I told you guys I don't know how to put on lashes. Like, I don't want to talk about it. It gets me emotional. I don't know how to do it, whatever. <laughs> Put some mascara, like I said, and then just to top it off, I always fix plus after. Um, move my hair out the way. And you want to like spray it down, like I'm like feeling this look, hey. <laughs> um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, please like and subscribe below. Um, Mary I'm Salif again. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Um, my Snapchat's too long. Mary I'm Mary I'm Salif on Twitter and Instagram. Um, and I'll see you guys next.